Guys, today I will show you a ridiculous legendary gear slash aspect farming method in Diablo 4 which can be turned into AFK XP and gold farm. Yes, you heard me right, my beautiful bastard. All the magic happens right here, so it means you can do this from the get-go at season 1. But before we continue, quick word from the sponsor, you for gm If you need some kind of help, these guys can help you all and they will give you the lowest price on the market. Use Butcher Code and have fun. In this exploit though, you have to travel to that location I showed you on the map, it's basically around the corner from our capital and you have to make sure that you are getting this poor soul activity and next thing is unfortunately RNG shit. You have to basically find this activity where this NPC goes to the left side and comes back to the right side. And what happens here, he will be stuck around this fallen tree. Guys, if he will be somewhere around this fallen tree, his path will be broken. He will not be able to complete his own road, so this activity will bug out. So once you basically escorted him to that fallen tree, simply fail the objective. Just leave him alone, let the time run out, and with that you're gonna bug out activity. What, in, what I mean by that? Endless waves of enemies. Since NPC can't complete his road, you will spawn endless amount of enemies. If you're a solo player, most likely you will find like 6, 8, 10 enemies at a time. If you're doing this with squad, there will be a bunch of enemies. And if you're doing this with squad, you can turn this easily into a FK farm. Make sure that you are spawning tons of enemies and simply stay here, die, doesn't matter because once you will be respawned, you will get all the gold from all the previously killed enemies, all the dropped items, all the jewelry, all the rocks, diamonds. You can collect everything, you can sell that crap, deconstruct, gain materials. You will gain here and there some legendary loot as well, but definitely for legendary loot, you have to farm uh, strongholds, not strongholds, excuse me, uh, dungeons, nightmare dungeons. Uh, yesterday I showed you one really dope dungeon with uh, drowned enemies, which has high uh, chance to drop you some nice unique items. So definitely check that dungeon, but this is purely for XP, for gold, and since it's near our capital, you can do this at early stages of your playthrough from season 1, especially at season 1 new character has already a uh, map revealed if you have done it previously with your uh, hard, fresh character <laughs> which you're playing right now and like I said you can turn this into the AFK mode uh, timer uh, well, objective can go on as you see this bar if somebody will run into the circle of this uh, soul uh, yes, uh, it will make the progression keep moving forward, but still activity will be bugged out because uh, poor soul can't finish uh, his uh, objective. It, it's simple as that, man. So yeah, if you need uh, legendary items in higher rate, go for Nightmare Dungeons. This is really nice as, at the beginning of the game when people are farming again, unlocking the map, uh, collecting all the altars and that's the reason why you can do this in AFK mode because everyone will try to collect again Lilith altars to gain all the boosts for the new fresh seasonal characters. So people will come and go here and they will try to complete this activity, kill all the enemies for you and you can simply collect all the gold, time running out, objective has been already failed. So it's super, super, super dope farming method. You can level up your character really quickly. Uh, yes, um, like I said, pretty, pretty uh, dope. But again, since it's a kind of exploit, uh, I don't know. Uh, mm. But again, it's RNG gods. I mean, you have to manage that uh, this soul comes and stucks basically at that poor tree. Uh, I know. Ah, bye.